In today's video, I'm going to be unboxing something that will maybe, maybe replace my prized possession megaphone. The megaphone I've had for over 20 years now. It's done me well, you know, but it's heavy. It takes D cell batteries and um, yeah, it's time to upgrade. I had a company representative by the name of Angel contact me and ask me if I wanted to review their personal amplifier. I said, absolutely. So let me put this aside. Okay. So there it is. I believe you pronounce that Shidu or Shidu, something like that. Original voice amplifier. So, oh, of course we're gonna run into these issues with the lighting. Hold on. Okay, so it's a loudspeaker. It has a recorder. Yes, a recorder with micro uh, SD cards. There's an auxiliary input. It can be used as a power bank. And uh, yeah, so let's see. I received, let me, let me get this right. So it's the M800 UHF model green all right so let's open it up by the way i did already unbox this and i'm like wait a minute i meant to do this on camera so i put it i put it together kind of haphazardly but or haphazardly but yeah here we go so here's the main module i'll take that out of the bag later and then underneath that piece we have our headset. So wireless headset. I'll open that later as well. Charger, which as many of us know, you know, they don't put power adapters in, in a lot of devices nowadays for some reason. So that's nice to see. Looks like it's a possibly a TRRS cable as my stomach growls. And there's for the the power adapter, the cable for that, and then we have a strap and a user manual. So let's check this user manual out a little bit closer. So voice amplifier user manual SDM800. Cool. I'm glad they sent me the green one, by the way. That's that's the color I like the best. Kind of has like a little military look to it. So there you go. It is IPX5 waterproof, which what that means is it can handle like light rain, maybe medium rain, but not like pressurized water. Um, so don't take it in the shower with you. It's a, uh, let's see, it loud and clear voice. It has Bluetooth 4.2. So you can play music through this as well. Don't forget that. And it has a 4400 milliamp hour battery that's cool 3.7 volts and now this one threw me for a loop when i saw it on the website when i saw it on amazon I'm like what is a tf card but i'm glad that they put micro sd so a uh, tf card was the original name for micro sd and so some people use it interchangeably and let's see power bank function for emergency charging that's cool so it's actually an 18 watt maximum output it charges let's see it, it, it plays music for eight to ten hours it takes three to five hours to charge it is a big battery after all uh, ampl amplifies for 10 to 12 hours but from what i understand that's if you're plugged into it if you're using bluetooth i do wonder does the wireless does the headset use how does this work? I guess I'll, I'll keep reading the manual. Okay. Charge the speaker. Please turn the speaker off and charge it timely when a low battery with voice prompt. Okay, I'm going to charge this first. Let's see. Fully recharge it before you're first used. All functions will stop when charging. Okay, so you can't power it off the wall and use it at the same time. Please unplug the charger after it is fully charged. All right. And then we have power 
our switch. And what else? So that's all on. I guess I'll take this out of the bag. Ideally on camera. So there's the speaker. I don't. You know, it's funny on the on the website. I thought these controls would be like inside, but no, they're all on the outside. My, I think I. Oh, I have it upside down. Okay. And that's kind of interesting because if I had this on my belt, then that would be upside down, wouldn't it? Yeah. Okay, well. <laughs> oh, here's the here's the things I thought were internal. So it was the micro SD card inside of there. Come on. Okay, so there's the USB, there's a little card, and then, then the auxiliary audio. And I'm not sure... I'm not sure what that is. Is it, is it like the Bluetooth? Um, oh, here's the other side. Trying not to break it. Okay. Is it like another microphone input? All right, I'll just keep reading the manual. So maybe that's the charge. Oh, I know what it is. So this is the charger end. And then the USB is for charging. I'm sorry, for, yeah. Is for, is for the power bank option. That's what it is. Okay. Yeah, it's, it shows it on the diagram. So... You have the mode key, so you can put it Bluetooth, USB flash drive. Wait, so can I, can I, can I offload things of this too? Hmm, okay. Insert, you, you can do all kinds of things with this little, little device. 3.5 millimeter micro, microphone connector, and... To avoid howling or feedback, please do not point the microphone towards the speaker. All right. And DC 5 volt aux input audio files to audio cable connect to the computer. Okay, so that that is the TRRS or, or just TRS cable. Um, cool. So you can hook things through a cable as opposed to Bluetooth. Because Bluetooth. Definitely eats up more battery power for sure. Uh, maximum capacity for the micro SD is only 32 gigabytes. Okay, that's good to know. Uh, it can also play back MP3s. And I'm glad they record. I'm, gl I'm glad they included a user manual. Oh, so you charge. So everything's chargeable. The headset is chargeable. And the, so the speaker is actually what operates the longest, and the headset, I believe, works for like 90 minutes. Okay, the wireless microphone factory setting has been paired successfully. You can use it directly. If the microphone has no sound or the microphone is disconnected, you need to pair it ma manually. All right, I'll assume I'll have to do that. And you can read what's on screen. Long press the M to pair it. Okay. It's funny it says UHF, but it's actually Bluetooth, I think. Maybe it's not. I don't know. All right. Normal charge time. So if you want to charge both of these at the same time, then you'll need another cable, I believe. Oh, should I take it out of the bag? It's hard to do that while I'm holding a cell phone. I'll get it out of the bag later. But yeah, I'm going to be reviewing this within hopefully the next week. And I will compare it with my megaphone. I'll play some music through it in the meantime. Hear how the quality is. And let you guys know. If you have any questions for me, if you'd like me to do something in the review, 
to check this out. Um, I will provide a link to the product in the pinned comment and, and the video description. But yeah, check all this stuff out. And I'll let you guys know if it's good or not. That's like the most important thing because this is not, it's not a like $20 thingamajig. It's actually, you know, a $100 piece of equipment. I'll let you guys know whether I think it's good or not. I mean, I'll, I'll just compare it and you guys can make your own decision based off of that. How about that? Yep. And there's the support email address. Shy do. She do. See ya.